What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Ron and this is MotorTube. If you're stopping by for the first time, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Turn your notification bell on to stay up to date with my videos and be part of the family. So today we got another cool video coming up for you guys. So uh, it's actually a race with the Mustang. Um, I'm about to head over. It's one of my friends that has a really, really fast car. Um, it's going to be a pretty cool video to make. Um, this car and that car share one thing and that's the trans so uh comment below what you guys think the car is i mean never mind you already know by the title of the video but yeah we both have 10 speed auto um i'm gonna explain to you guys in the car what's the difference between mine and his so let's start the mustang and get going have a beautiful video whoop we're gonna say bye to the hellcat Bye bye. So the car I'm racing is a ZL1, um, a brand new ZL1. I think it's a 2017. You guys are probably like, yo, why are you racing? Have you lost your mind? Well, no. Um, I raced the Hellcat and I, 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 it beat me by like four cars or so. I want to race the ZL1 and see if if there's a difference because a lot of people go back and forth and say, oh, Hellcat is faster than ZL1. ZL1 is faster than Hellcat. So I'm just going to race a ZL1 and see if it's a bigger difference, if it's going to beat me by more than what the Hellcat beat me or if it's going to beat me by less than what the Hellcat beat me. Anyways, it's all for fun and I, I love having fun with friends and, you know, makes for good content as well. So, the, okay, the difference between, actually the similarities between the cars is they both have a 10-speed auto. And uh, I'll there's one thing that's different so Chevy and Ford have worked on it together the only thing is um, what my friend was telling me is uh, his when he downshift to second so let's say you're doing a 40 roll you downshift to second gear right and you just hit your foot on the gas once you once you downshift you have to keep shifting yourself and uh, that was not that's not the case in this car when I downshift this car it'll it'll shift for me so it'll just shift on its own so it's kind of weird that it's they're both the same 10 speed but i guess because it's on a much faster car i'm not sure why it's different but if you guys have an explanation let me know in the comments below so it's mine's like sort of like the hellcat where when you downshift it'll shift on its own after where the zl1 you got to shift it on your own after that once you downshift you got to shift it on your own so mine i could choose whether to shift it on my own or let it shift for me so that's pretty cool and I didn't even know that the ZL1 was like that until you told me so. There we are guys. Check out. It's all blacked out. Alright, as you guys can see I'm still stuck. Not for long, no, not for long. Let me show you guys the ZL1. Look at this. 6.2 liter supercharged. Let me show you guys the interior on this car. Actually, let me just show you guys around. Check out the wheels. These are my favorite wheels. And the brakes. Quad tips. Nightmare. They both have quad tips. You can't see them on mine as much as this. They come out a little more on this. Let me show you guys the interior. This has like the most fire interior I've ever seen. On an American car, of course. Red stitching, Alcantara all over, ambient lighting. The seats just wow. Recaro seats, they're not as sportier as mine, but just look how beautiful they look. Wow. Red seat belts, um, they, these look like pink to me. They look a little different, like the stitching looks different color than this. More Alcantara all over. Alcantara steering wheel. This thing is legit. No, of course, look, there's like, <laughs> no one can sit in the back. So, the, the, the interior is just so dope on this car. This is the side by side. Side by side. And of course, this is my Mustang for those of you who watch it for the first time. Let me know how many cars I'm going to lose by in the comments below. Ready to go. Alright guys, since this is for fun, I kind of asked for the leave and uh, he kind of just said let's do heads up. So, um, I'm going to try to jump on him and just take the hit basically. Probably jump on like two or something like that. Uh, I need to do this because... 
because uh, that car is so fast to believe. One, two, three! So I didn't do a good job at jumping on that one. Uh, I'm gonna try to jump the next one. I'll probably go on like two or something. Cause I have no chance against this car. The only way I have a chance is if I try to jump. So let's see how that goes. We're about to do a 60, which is the worst roll for me. But I'm gonna take the jump on it and we'll see how it goes. jump that good? yeah they were good I, yeah I had to I even said I even <laughs> said it in a video I'm like I have to jump there's no way this car is so fast good, good race yeah, that was a fun. oh man it sounds it sounds better and faster than it was before does it it's yeah broken in now. That's right it, it sounds it sounds a lot better now man. I think everything's like broken in, everything's well how many miles does it have right now uh, 700. yeah you're good yeah, try re Everything is, it's ready to go now. Try, run, try running some Hellcast now. Yeah, I'm going to now. You have. He looks so good on black. They both look Dude, broken. your wheels are like the most, the nicest wheels I've seen on a car. Stock car. For a stock, it's like, look how sophisticated they look. And your brakes are huge. These cars look dope, bro. I know. <laughs> Just because it's black. They're both black. I'm so glad I, I'm so glad I blacked this out. I like that, and the black rims look dope too. See, mine are like a dark charcoal. I, I kind of like that. It, 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 I like I, it too, but that'd be sweet if, if they were black. Be you could, you could. If they were black, the brakes would pop up a little more. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I think it looks good the way it is, because it has a little red in the ZL1 and everything. I want to see the dash real quick. I think it's a lot. Is your keys here? Uh, Let me see your keys. Yeah, dude, it fell a lot faster. Did it? Yeah. Like, you took off right, right away. I think it cuts like half the power out. Yeah, if it's not broken in. Right. 200 on the dash. Yep, you're, yeah. Looks good. These ambient lights look amazing. You, you, you haven't figured out how to change the colors? Yeah, I know how. Oh, you know? Okay, that's good. Dude, these seats are so good. comfortable. You go to home. Where? Hit home. No, right there. Left, all the way left. No, here. See the top? Right oh. there. And then you go to... People color you want and it'll change. White. Oh, I see green. Look at that. It's changing colors. That's sick. Blue? I like the green. I might just leave it green. Yeah, this green looks sick. It's a little delay, but... Look at that. Yeah, the green looks sick. Yeah, look, it's green everywhere now. Oh, this car is awesome. He's leaving. Man, it sounds beautiful. I literally have 12 miles to E. Never in any car that I've owned, just because I've owned Mopar, I'd ever let it get that low just because when you're in a Mopar and it says that, you're like, by that, it, what, you wouldn't even get to the point where it says 12 miles to E just because you would already ran out of gas. But this car is so good on gas that, I mean, I'm almost at empty and it's still going. So we're about like a mile away from the gas station. Get 
this thirsty car going. So we're back home, had a long day. So um, the reason why I do these races, I'm like the Mythbusters of YouTube. Like I will experience every single race possible. I will, um, even though, you know, it's like, oh, the other car is gonna win for sure. I like to know how bad I'd lose, how bad I'd win. You know what I'm saying? I like to test everything out and it, it makes for good content and a lot of people like it So I'm gonna continue to do that, but uh, also name other cars I could race before my car goes in to get modded comment in the comments below something within like 450 horsepower to 500 horsepower range right around there. Maybe 400 to 500. Let me know I pretty much raced everything. I can't think of anything else. So comment in the comments below But anyways, I'm gonna let you guys go. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, Man, we're almost at 30,000 subscribers. I don't know when this video post hopefully we're we'll be at 30,000 subscribers, but if we're not we're gonna get there so that's all I care about um, we're doing good so far we're growing as a family and uh, I wouldn't be able to do none of this without you guys so thank you guys for all your support you guys mean a lot and also uh, I'm gonna uh, my merch is gonna come out pretty soon. I'm, I'm almost done with the design so I'm having a guy uh, Design you know design my logo so it's gonna be a pretty sweet logo like I said I'm putting my you know hard, I'm working hard at it so I'm not just I'm not I'm not just giving you guys an, just anything okay so I'm gonna make sure it's it's perfect and it comes out amazing for you guys so just bear with me and uh, it should be out pretty soon so just stay tuned for that but anyways if you guys like this video give it a big thumbs up if you're new to this channel go ahead and smash that subscribe button because I don't know what you're waiting for and hit that notification bell to stay up to date with my videos so it can notify you whenever a new video drops and I will see you guys next video have a beautiful day stay positive Chase your dreams. Peace.